the Universal Declaration of Human Rights, Article Number One. All human beings are born equal and free, equal in dignity and in rights. They are endowed with reason and conscience and should act toward one another in a spirit of sister and brotherhood. Oh, freedom. Oh, freedom. Statelessness has been probably the most forgotten aspect of human rights in the international community. When they've told me what their daily lives are like, it is unimaginable. I'll be buried in my grave and go home to my Lord and be free. This is something that is an anomaly in the 21st century. This is something that's totally unacceptable in today's world. This is a solvable problem. Already we have seen instances where countries ended this type of discrimination. Brazil had a very positive experience in implementing both UN conventions on statelessness. Argentina has recently ratified the Convention on the Reduction of Stateness. The role of the civil society is absolutely vital, especially in an area where there is enormous lack of knowledge and awareness about what it represents in the world. Today, I formally announce the launch of the America's Network on Nationality and Statelessness. Our hope is to see the Americas as the first continent to eradicate statelessness. UNHCR's global action plan to end statelessness is ambitious, but it should be achievable. We're quite convinced that we can do it in the Americas if we all work together. It's a remarkable movement within a continent. Mm -hmm.